Welcome to Mother Daughter Projects. Today we're going to show you how to replace a broken light switch. In mom's bedroom over the last couple weeks, when she turns on her light, nothing happens. But when she turns on her fan, that still works. To replace this switch, we need a single pole switch, Phillips and flathead screwdriver, and a voltage tester. We're going to start by removing the light switch cover. We bought a replacement light switch from Home Depot, but once we took the light switch off, we realized it had different wiring on the front than our original. Our original light switch also had push-in fittings on the back, and our new light switch had terminal screws on the side. We returned that switch and found the exact switch we needed to replace this one on Amazon. We tested the wires by putting one end of our voltage tester on the ground wire and the other on each terminal screw. You can see here the tester light comes on when there's still power running to the switch. Before removing the old switch, we turned off the power to this switch. After the power was off, we tested again, and you can see the voltage tester did not light on either of the switches. Next, we removed the single pole switch that was not working and used a flathead screwdriver to release the wires from the back of the switch. By the way, the red wire here is a hot wire, just as the black wire is that we removed from the back. With push-in fittings on the new light switch, we just pushed the wires into place and screwed the switch back. If you don't have push-in fittings, you would wrap and tighten the wires around the terminal screws. We turn the power back on at the circuit panel and success! The light switch turns on the light and the other switch turns on the fan. For more home maintenance projects, please visit us at motherdaughterprojects.com.